65 News reporter Sydney Eisenberg is here with a look at the latest COVID-19 numbers from our coronavirus tracker desk. Sydney. Now, as coronavirus cases across the country continue to rise, two major food chains are now joining a growing list of companies who will now require masks inside of their businesses. McDonald's and Chipotle announced today that they will be joining that list and refusing customers who do not wear a mask inside any of their locations. Supermarket company Winco is also requiring facial coverings. Now, here in Texas, masks are required in businesses and restaurants, according to Governor Abbott's mask mandate. Now, masks can be removed once a customer is seated at a restaurant. Closer to home, McLennan County experienced one of its deadliest weeks this week when it comes to COVID-19. Since Monday, the virus has claimed 11 lives. The oldest patient was 97, while the youngest was 43. The county has seen 413 new cases this week, the highest in Central Texas. Brazos County reported 228 new cases, while Bell reported 202. Central Texas as a whole saw 1,098 new reported cases since Monday. There are 2,884 total COVID-19 cases in Bell County, according to county officials. The state, which includes Fort Hood in its count, reports 2,990 for the area. Brazos County officials report 3,600 total cases, while McLennan County has 3,800 total cases. Now, breaking those numbers down, an estimated 1,800 cases are active in McLennan, while 2,000 have recovered. Bell County has roughly 1,600 actives and 1,200 recoveries, while in Brazos County, 734 people are actively fighting the virus. Over 2,800 people have recovered. Live from the Coronavirus Tracker Desk, Sydney Eisenberg, 25 News.